All right, so it is actually toy day today and we're gonna go dreamy hunting because I'm pretty sure Lyman has moved out. But I guess Santa's helper is also visiting the island today. We're gonna run into Jingle. Oh, she didn't say anything about Lyman. Hopefully I didn't get this date wrong, but I'm pretty sure Lyman is moving out because in the previous video, he asked to move out. And I think it's been two days since then. So we'll check if his plot is open. But first, you know, I had to change up the outfit because everybody else is gonna be wearing Santa hats on toy day. So I wanna fit in. And I also changed my hair to red because I kind of like just switching up my hair color. I think it's fun, but let's see where Jingle even is. Oh, literally right here. Hi, buddy. I kind of forget what toy day is though. I think you like give your villagers toys or something, but I have not been buying any. Okay, ho ho ho, happy holidays. I'm Jingle, the black nosed reindeer. This is the most special and exciting time of the year, isn't it? And today is the most exciting day of all. It's toy day. Now I've got the very best job I can think of in the whole world. I get to help Santa deliver presents. So ho ho, how's your toy day going so far? I hope it's as merry as can be. Unfortunately, I've got a small problem that's not very merry at all. I forgot the wrapping paper. Oh, okay, I have to like make him wrapping paper or something. Ho ho, I just had a thought. Something about DIY, why not? What do you say, kid? Can you help? It would it would be who for the both of us, even though I'm kind of all set, hoof-wise. Here's the recipe, it'll be great. Just craft a little wrapping paper and we'll pretend this didn't happen. Girl, I'm trying to go dreamy hunting. I'm going to do this later. But thank you for the DIY recipe. Three pieces of special paper. Okay, great. I'll do that after. But we need to go check and see if Lyman actually moved out. Oh my god, Shino. She looks really cute. So I believe his plot is over here. Next to Vesta's house. Okay, yeah. We're good. Plot is available. Cool. Um, I think the villagers I'm most looking for are Sasha because Sasha's a new one. Maybe any new one, I don't know. I kind of want to switch it up because there's a lot of villagers I like, but I have had them before. I haven't had Lily though. Honestly, I think I'd want any frog villager. Vesta looks adorable as well. Oh, but I totally forgot I need to get my Nook Miles tickets. They're still in my house. Let me think of other villagers that I might like. I like Molly. She's really cute. Maybe I'll get like a cat villager. I kind of like Olivia. I don't know. I think we'll go with someone who I've never had before, but someone that's still cute to me. But, you know, I'm not really that picky. But Sasha would be fun. All right, we got the Nook Mile tickets. I'm just gonna take 40 because I'm imagining it won't take that long. A lot of the villagers are pretty cute. Plus, I think I can find like the ugly villagers cute in their own way too. Like I didn't really like Goose at first. He's not really ugly though, but he's not really my like type, I guess, a villager. But like I've learned to love him. Same with Midge. Like I would have never picked Midge. She's not really like my kind of villager that I go for, but I love her. She's a queen. It's the personality, not how they look, guys. Okay, we're here. Oh my. Oh my gosh, even Orville has a little hat on. That is so cute, but it's kind of sad that he's just like in the airport while everybody's partying outside. Anyway, I would like to fly. Yes, King, I have the Nook Miles on me. All packed and ready, time for takeoff. Let's do this. I'm excited. Okay, hello Wilbur, we're here at the first island. I'm excited. Who's it gonna be? Oh gosh. Oh, I think, is that Rodney? I saw a little sneaky peeky in the corner. Oh, Walt. I don't know their names. Anyway, don't believe we met. Name's Walt. Fancy meeting you here. Uh, wherever here is. I'm a mite fuzzy on that part, Pockets. You're Elena, right? From Kimetsu? You're a long way from home. Or at least I think you are. I don't really want an animal with five o'clock shadow. Also, I know we said we're not judging based on appearance, but like, he looks like he could beat me up. And I'm just, you know, we're just gonna keep going, I think. But I am gonna take this fossil because I still need like one or two more fossils for my museum and then I think I'll be done. But like, I literally cannot find it. It does not exist. So hopefully maybe this will be the right one. We're also gonna try and kind of speed run this because I mean, there's no point in wasting so much time like deforesting every single island we go to. Like we gotta get it going. We gotta see, see the villager, get in, get out, all of that. Like we're going super quick. So we're gonna go to island number two now. Let's go. All right, we're here at island number two. Honestly, I was just thinking, isn't it crazy how I've almost been playing this game for two years? I think that's crazy. Oh, hello. I forget his name. Uh, bam. Oh, wasn't gonna guess that. I was gonna say like Bruce or something. <laughs> Elena, hot, and from Kimetsu, all right, it's cool to meet you. Well, I'm gonna get back to surviving. Let me know if you need help lifting a tree or something, kablang. Uh, we're gonna pass on him as well. He's not speaking to me. He's cute though. Oh, but we did get a message in a bottle. What did we get? Golden vase. Ooh, something new. Thank you. That's fun. Okay, I guess I will not be taking Bam, but I'm gonna take this fossil. Very cool. Okay, 
Let's see, island number three now. Okay, we're here. Wilbur, please give me some good luck. Somebody cute who I might like. Maybe a frog. Oh, it's a horse. <laughs> I like horses too. He seems kind of nice. Who is this? Elmer. Oh yeah, like the Elmer's glue. Got it, got it. Um, you're visiting too. Hey, I'm Elmer. You're Elena from Kimetsu. Neat. I didn't expect to meet a friend here. This island is so cool. Tenderfoot. Okay. Bit of an odd catchphrase, but um, I think we're gonna keep going just for the fun of doing it over and over again, you know? This is only island number three. I have to keep my options wide, you know? So we're gonna keep going. I don't know if there's a fossil or something over here. Hmm. I don't see one. Island number four. Let's see who we have now. Who's hiding over here? Who is it? Oh! Hi. Oh my god. What is her name? Annabelle? She was like my first dreamy hunt video or like my first ever villager hunting thing. Like the first villager I ever found when I first played New Horizons. And I didn't know that you like could keep going to islands. I just thought you would take the first one that you get. And it was Annabelle. I'm sure I have a picture of us somewhere that I'll insert. But yeah, Annabelle is like an OG. It's great to meet you. How are you? I'm Annabelle. Welcome to my hype-tastic island getaway. Okay, it's not my island, but it will be. I want to be a pop star, and all pop stars own islands. For sure, for sure. I thought she was cute, but I already had her, so we're going for somebody else. But we do love Annabelle. She's iconic. But we found another message in a bottle. Let's see what we got from Pierce. Wooden field sign. Do I have this? I guess not. This is great. Getting new DIYs. I feel like I always get the same DIYs that I already have over and over again. Okay, okay, let's go to the next island. The next island. Who will it be this time? Let's see. Got a lot of apple trees here. Hello, hello. Oh! Oh my god, I forget literally all their names. Um, Hornsby. He is very cute looking. Hi! Nice to meet you. I'm Hornsby. I'm visiting this island today. You're Elena from Kimetsu. That's really cool. Yeah, they all say the same thing over and over again. But he is pretty cute. <laughs> I don't know if I want to get him though because I'm pretty sure my sister had him at some point. I mean, that's like not a reason for me to not get one. I just... Honestly, I just want to keep doing it because it's kind of fun to keep going to islands over and over again. Plus, he doesn't really speak to me. Like, he's cute, but maybe I can find somebody else. I don't know. This is my thought process. But I definitely have, like, I have 35 more tickets, so there's so many more islands we can visit. And we're gonna do it, just for funsies. So let's do it. Okay, here we go again. Let's see. Oh, I think that's Dobby, right? Or Doby? Dobby or Doby, I don't know. Hi, I'm Doby. I'm just gonna pick a name and say it. Okay, came here on a whim, but this island doesn't seem half bad. Not really my vibe. He's cute though, but we're gonna keep looking. Beep boop, beep boop. Wait, oh, I kinda want a robot. Like, robot? <gasps> cute. Next island, please be a frog. Please be a frog. I don't know if I should change my objective and just try and get any kind of frog or whoever speaks to me, but I'd be wanting a frog. <laughs> Colton? He, he was on my island before and then I kicked him out. I think he was my first mug. Do you, do you remember me, dude? Uh, clearly not. Okay. Great. Literally, you forgot about me. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. So I will not be taking him because I already have had him. Okay, the next island. This could be island 7 or 8. I already forgot. Let's see who we have here. Oh, a piggy! Piggy, 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 piggy. Oh, I kind of want a monkey villager. That's reminding me of a monkey. Spork. Oh, hey, nice to meet you. I'm Spork. Cool, so you're Elena. Blah, blah, blah. He's, I don't think I'm, Is he new? I've never seen this one before. But maybe he's not. But I do kind of want Nana, the pink monkey. She's really cute. But I don't think that I want little Spork over there. I don't I actually don't think he's new. But I don't think I've ever seen him before, but I probably have. Because I have villager hunted a lot. But yeah, we're gonna keep going. Bye, Spork. Okay. Alright, keeping it going, keeping it going. Who's it gonna be, Wilbur? Somebody cute? Who is it? Oh, wait! I want her, actually. Is that Margie? 
Honestly, she's so cute. She's so cute. Margie, yes. I remember her from City Folk when I first played Animal Crossing. And I always liked her because I liked her color palette and I always thought she was really cute and she got like the little winged liner. Like she's a queen. Well, hello there. My name's Margie. You're Elena? Wait, you came here all the way from Kimetsu? You're definitely more well-traveled than me. I'm trying to fix that by trying new places like this island. Mom always says there's magic and chance encounters, so I'm glad you ran into each other like this. Honestly, I'm really contemplating getting her. Like, she's very cute. I've never had her before. She's a queen. Look at her. Oh my god, we could be best friends. I'm always like, I want these villagers and these villagers at the beginning of every video and then I'm like, wait a damn minute, I forgot this villager and I think they are cute. Like, I probably would have never been like, oh, I really want Margie. But like, I do though. Like, I don't know how to explain it. I said I would pick a villager who speaks to me and honestly, Margie speaks to me. She's a queen, I'm going back over there. Girl, where are you? Ah, ah, ah. Where'd she go? She disappeared. Margie, ah, ah, don't jump off the cliff. Okay, Margie. She's a baddie, right? And I don't think I've ever had many- I don't think- Have I even had an elephant villager? Like, I don't even know. I do want a frog though, but ugh, she's so cute. I think I'm just gonna invite her because I like her. I think she's pretty neat. It must be true what they say about how travel broadens your horizons. This change of scenery has given me a new perspective on life back on my island. I like it well enough, but- Doing it. Move to my island. Ah! Impulse. I did it. I did it. She's cute. I like her. She's a queen. Um, okay. Do you really mean it, Tootie? Oh my god, Tootie. Fart, fart. Yes, queen, of course I meant it. Oh, this is all so exciting. I can't wait to start packing up for my big move after this tour. Ooh, I kind of want to design a house for her now. Like, it could be, like, red and yellow to match her little her little look, her little skin, her little elephant pattern. I think she's very cool and very neat. And I like her. She's not one of them that I set out looking for, but I like her. I think she's cool. I think this satisfies eight-year-old me who would have wanted her in her Animal Crossing City Folk town. Oh, she's all the way over here in the corner. I like her. Oh, come over here into the frame, girly. All right, we did that. Way quicker than I was anticipating with only nine Nook Miles tickets. I say that's pretty good. Now I gotta check to see if there's a fossil or message in a bottle real quick. And then we'll go back to the island and that'll be great. I also wanna show you that all the gyroids I've gotten. I've got like a lot of gyroids lately. And there's like, I think two or three that I need to still dig up. So that'll be a surprise for us to look at. Okay, let's go. All right, let's go see Miss Margitha's little house plot. Miss Margiantha. Sorry, that was too close to Joey Gosepa. This spot is reserved for Margie's new home. That's iconic. Vesta, what do you think about it, girl? Are you into it? Are you into it? Your new neighbor. Have you met Jingle the reindeer yet? He's visiting the island today. Girl, I know that. <laughs> There's only one reason anyone would make the flight in this kind of weather. He must have brought gifts. That's really great, Vesta. I'm glad that makes you excited. Goose, 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 goose. Uh, get out of the way. I'm sorry. Goose. Ah, ah. Sorry. Pushing him around. Oh my god, Shino is still looking at this Christmas tree. Anyway, I want to show you the little gyroids I got. I think they're nice. Oh, this is one of them. I ran out of room in the gyroid farm, so we have to move a little guy over here. All right, let's see what we got in here. We have a boomoid. Okay, I don't know if I have that one yet, but it sounds new. And then I think we have two more up here. Like, what do you look at all these gyroids I have now? All right, this one, which is a crumploid. Are they going to crump? Okay, cool. And then this one up here, who do we have? It's a Wurroid. Wurroid? Girl, these are hard to say. But we are going to plop one down right here and see. We'll do the Boomoid first. Hello, little guy. Oh, he's quite, quite cute. I quite like him. Oh, very nice. And then I guess we'll put the other two right here. So we have the Crumploid. Hello there. Oh, okay. He looks He looks kinda like SpongeBob when he doesn't have any water. And he's like, water. And then Sandy's like, what? A wouch, a wowlet, a wowshin machine. Anyway, here's the the Wurroid. Oh, it's quite cool looking. I'm gonna zoom in. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Um, I don't know how many gyroids there are. Look at her spinning the globe over here. Wow, that's so fun. I definitely probably don't have all of them, but I think they're very neat. So Goose is going to serenade us as we end this video. Thank you for watching. I'm going to do the little jingle quest off camera because it might be a little bit boring since it's the same kind of quest as last year, I'm pretty sure. So I'm going to do that and I'll add a little clip at the end, of course, when Margie moves in. And I'm also going to add a clip of all of the gyrates that I have singing one of the KK Slider songs. So I think that would be cute. So look forward to that. 
in a few seconds. But thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, gamers!